Do you do y'all hear me? Yep. Yeah. Okay. So if you want if you're single and you don't want them taxing you at the highest rate, which is the single rate, you can put on your W4 married. Okay? You can put married with three dependents. And it's not illegal. What that will affect is how much money you pay in all year. Okay? So when you file your taxes, come April, all right, you put, when you put down what your status actually is, then you can say, okay, I should have paid in a little more because it's low. But I'd rather my clients have a tax budget line and they have $500 that they put into that budget all year long at 4.5% interest or 4% interest or even 2% interest, okay? Instead of giving it to the government for free. And then when they file their taxes, they owe $380. They take that $380 out of that tax savings account that they've gotten that 4% interest on. Am I making sense? All right? Rather than giving it to Uncle Sam and all you get back is that $380. Okay? If you're getting something back. All right? Or if you can't, you're just paying what you owe. So people get mad when they owe taxes, but that means you've captured all your money for 12 months and you live on that income for 12 months and now you got to give them something back. Okay, and if it's less than a thousand dollars, there is no penalty. Okay? Y'all feel me? So it's all about strategizing, planning, deciding what your end game is. Alright? Question? Yeah, do you think it's less than a thousand or maybe more than a thousand? There's a penalty. Five percent. Oh, okay. It's, it's a crazy calculation, but it works out to like five five percent, point point zero five percent. So sometimes it's worth it. If you have something you need to get done and you know that you're gonna be able to pay the money back when it's time to pay taxes, then I say don't pay and pay when it's time to pay. But just pay on order before April fifteenth. Okay, so that you don't get additional penalties and interest. Okay, because you gotta, you gotta look at all the details. That look, the money you paying for that penalty was worth it for you to do whatever it is you needed to do. Okay? Y'all feel me on that? Makes sense? You're not going to jail. You are not going to jail over this. Okay? <laughs> it is your profit. It is your right. Alright? You have a liability. It's a pay as you go system. You do have a liability. But as long as you satisfy that liability within the time frame that's set for it, April 15th for regular uh, taxes, not April, uh, May 15th, and different dates for other tax situations. But as long as you pay by your date, you go to the date and come to mess with you. Okay? So these W-4s are very important. Okay? If you haven't filled out a state W-4, and like I said, you got $200 back, refund, I really, 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 unless that's what you want to do. Unless you want to wait till April, May, and June, get your money. You know, people used to use it as a savings plan. I don't need it. I do my budget. I got my savings line. That money is already going into my savings, getting my 4%. Because you're giving them, that's your savings, but you ain't getting no interest on it. So you ain't getting no money on that savings plan. You're using it. You're using your tax refund. If you give your money to the government, you get a tax refund. Does that make sense? Yeah. Me? Okay. Question. Any more questions? Right here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hi. Yeah. Um, you hear me? Huh? You want to go? Yes. Thank you very much. I'm glad you brought that forward. Um, recently, um, I was working on a client who happened to change immediately to another agency. So I did another agency and they gave me that form, which I had never filled. And 
it really put up with me on feeling it because I was not getting it. So when you say it's a state kind of form, can you please clarify more? Because many of you have made mistakes. If, so if those mistakes now are, I see them after your speech, what can I do? No, I'm, I'm, I'm Boston. For Boston, yeah. all